go. Without taxes, especially, you're going to be paying that 25%. That's going to be $15. That pretty much is minimum wage in New York City. God bless. Whoa. Minimum time wage raise. Go. Time anyways, is over. PS2. He's to the next game. No more. No more shouting out from the crowd here. Utopian right. Ray playing Olimar. Utopian Ray playing Olimar against Jen's uh, increasingly prevalent wolf pick. Secondary versus secondary. I dig it. All right, getting a good start off there with a jab block. Uh, armor's out of that. That is really good. I think that's frame one armor still. Yes, no. Uh, not sure. Wait, oh, wait, on the whistle? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Uh, it, it, it's, it has super armor for a very, uh, very brief moment. <laughs> very um, strong option for getting out of juggles, especially because it doesn't really pull Alomar anywhere, and he's uh, more or less in a short animation. So I'm under the belief that this game one is incredibly important, based solely on the fact that I see this going to, coming down to a counter pick war. The fact that they started Alomar versus Vox leads me to believe that this was a double blind pick, and after this, you know, if Ray loses, He's gonna wait for uh, Jen to pick a character and then make a counter pick based off that, you know, or, or vice versa. I was I was about to say um, that I, I can agree with that, and I was gonna say I think that stock is very important because then Jen can just sort of play it patient, and Olimar doesn't really have too many great aggression tools, and then he gets up smash. Up smash, baby! Hey, one for one, you know, an eye for an eye. I don't want to give anyone my eye. Yeah, here we go. Up we tilt, need 61 damage on my boy. Eyes are not optional. He can't get that Pikmin off him. No, you no. saw, like, Fox, sometimes, depending on where that Pikmin's placed, can be tricky. It is, especially depending on how your character attacks. Honestly, um, just go for forward air. Um, I'm pretty sure you can also shield and wiggle to get Pikmin off, but I'm not sure if that's true or not. Nah, um, that sounds sus. Yeah. Ooh, where you going? Uh, thing is, zone. Firefox has a pretty predictable recovery See, and goes at the same time every single time. Many people may not know this, but uh, Olimar is an astronaut. He's done the math on those kinds of recoveries. He knows where you're going. You're not getting back against that. Just because he's an astronaut doesn't mean he passed out to man. True. Fair. And again, he has to keep track of all his Pikmin. How, how, much, how much math do you really need to do to sit in the spaceship and go to space? It was, on, it was on autopilot, <laughs> bro. Here we go. Dash attack, 117. Looking for a back here. All right. Or a sour spot right, there and dumps smart. Oh! Yikers. Brings out the fat boy. So, purple Pikmin. Uh, oh, that is strongest. Monique. Hold on. That is Monique. <laughs> we don't body shame Pikmin out here. Monique. I, I'm not body shaming. Well, okay, maybe a little. You did a little bit. He, look, he is I'm large, listening. but he is powerful. He's also a girl. She is large and girl. powerful. Actually, I don't know. Do Pikmin have genders? I actually have no idea. Are they, you know, that's the, a... They're plants, so they plants don't have, don't they, have genders. They don't have mouths. Right? How can they have gender? Listen, Bill Nye taught me about photosynthesis back in the day, so. Anyways, PS2, game two. Yep, PS2, game two. Pulling out the Pikmin 2. Uh. So we're staying on both Olimar and Dead. Fox, not oh. any change. I wanted, I wanted to. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, I guess there is no uh, advantage going on here. Oh, the thing is, I think, honestly, Ray was just like, I feel confident with Olimar, and Jen's not going to be going Palu against all of our because he feels more confident with Fox in this match. He wants to play the rushdown character against someone who's his owner. I mean, that's fair because with both of these players, if you're going to see Jen pick something, it's going to be Fox or Palutena. So either the Palutena ditto, uh, Palutena against Olimar, or he can play Fox against both those characters and have a decent time. All right, got the Pikmin off and gets it off it. Thankfully, that's the white, which does the least damage. Yeah. It tries to go for the other. <laughs> Jen just likes going for raw up smashes. I can appreciate it, though. I mean, as Olimar, you have the luxury of being able to go for that, so I understand why. Oh, oh yeah. he didn't get a tech. Uh, unfortunately for Jen, he was expecting a tech. He's back right here. Good back the platform. Catches him, looks at pointing up to the sky, and sends him off to the other way. Now we got purple in our midst. All right. What a sneaky boy. Now, or a girl. For the, yes, exactly. Plants. A sneaky plant, a sneaky Bang. Pikmin. Object. Okay, very nice. Tool. So for those who don't know. Tool. Whoa. It is we're gonna, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna move two past purples, that one. Two purples, baby. Two purples, two big beautiful ones right over here. BBP, big beautiful Pikmin, available now for only two Shut pulls. Up. <laughs> That's godlike. Here we go. 48 damage on Chen already. Not letting him get down to the ground. All right. So for those who don't know, if you throw the purple Pikmin, they act as traditional projectiles. They no longer grab onto you, but they do a ton of damage up front. They also make it very hard for Olimar to recover, being the so what do you want? What do you want to do? You want to F smash that purple pigment, get rid of the purple pigs. And Was that a punish? No. Yep. No way. What do you mean? With a drop shield? 
Forward smash? He up smashed his shield. True, but I don't know. I guess I thought he was slower. He up smashed his shield. Well, I mean, you know, with all those big Pikmin on his could forward smash <laughs> him out of shield. Well, he's Krom. Bowser could forward smash. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not Bowser. One stock apiece. All right. One stock each. Got a Pikmin beating on him. Uh, that's another thing that does also extend your hit and hurt boxes when you hit the Pikmin, which makes it more easy for Olmar to punish you. Spacing out with laser a little bit, probably a good call here. Returning some of the percentages Pikmin are dealing out. Okay, we got oh. a blue Pikmin in our midst. That means he's going to be looking for a grabby grab with those guys. Mm -hmm. Longest range on that one. And uh, is it that one or the white one that does the most pummel damage? I get them mixed up. Uh, no, no, neither. No Pikmin. Uh, that was a Smash 4 Brawl thing. It's oh, ultimate. you are right. Pummels are only affected by Olimar himself because he smacks a bitch. That's absolutely correct. All right, all right. Good Rapid jab. Any follow-up, rushes in, tries to look for something there, not trying to commit too much. He's got two purples and a blue. Is the dream come true? Oh, no, his blue died. Well, he's got double purple. What more could you ask for? Yep, he's got two bays to accompany him in the absence and one red joining him. Up smash. Yes, oh, sir. It's just raw. I felt that in my just bones. Just raw. That was I a hard that in my bones. Who does that? I knew he was going to roll, dog. Who does that? The actually, second I no. saw Jen face and right, I was like, he's going to roll like a sucker and he's going to up smash him and do a somersault. I, 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 that, didn't, that didn't actually happen the way that did. Of course it did. <laughs> Jen and I are on the same wavelength. It's fine. Here we go. Game three. Final oh, D. Oh, no. You know, I feel like that would have been better if he had been holding it because then you could just account it to nerves. But he like, he just straight roadrunnered that. He was like, Wiley Coyote, this is this is good. Well, to the roll reason into. he went for he didn't want to hold this because in case he went, goes for a different option, then he could opt to just uh, do something else and not get get and, as and punished. Yes, rolls are reactable, but still, that was just so. I agree with Jen's pick. Yeah. Uh, music stage. pick, music pick or stage pick because uh, for a lot of people. That up smash pick. Here we go. Off to right. go for up smash off off. Covers the jump with the Pikmin toss right there. Doesn't actually get him any uh, hit stun on that, but adds on additional damage while he's off stage. He was fine. Shine's also a really good tool for getting Pikmin off here. All right. Uh, kind of just trading balls on this one. Slugging it out a little bit. Still got the Pikmin on him. All right. Knocks him off, gets back down with the heavy armor. So there was that thing where uh, Joker or Palu can reflect a Pikmin back to Olimar, yes. and then Olimar can spike himself with down air. Really? Yeah. So <laughs> I think that, does that include Fox's reflect? Because I would love to see that. that Maybe. That'd be my dream come true. See, the thing is, right, is that uh, when you reflect standard projectiles, they go the opposite direction of whatever they came at you from. So maybe? I don't know. All right, doesn't get any follow-up there, but was looking for the whistle just in case he had one. Chases down the reflector. All right, that's a good punish. Now, although they can be tossed in the air and they are pretty fast, Olimar's Pikmin are still standard fireballs. Jumping in does work a good good amount there. Lands right on top of him. That was really scary. Golly gosh, this pro this pressure is still displaying right now, man. But man, he's at 91%. Oh, that was, that was scary. Ops yes, get the parry, right. but it was a multi-hit. And Mabel's to get hurt off that said multi-hit. Gets the up smash. And Jen, one stock away, moving on to winner's finals. Back where he, uh, you know, the king is back. Managed to get the stock. Yep. Although Utopian Ray certainly showing his colors right now with Pikmin, if you will. Uh, I mean, they're, they're all colorful, yes. Exactly. Well, except the white one. I don't know. Is white a color or is yeah, white a lack white, of yes. color? Yes. Is white a color or a lack it's of color? It's all the colors to get. Wait, is it? No. No, because I, I didn't fail art school. Hold white, on. White, white is no hue, all saturation. Right. And, uh, and black is all the colors. I'll yeah, talk. black is yeah. no saturation. Wait. Or, yeah, no saturation, all colors, all hue. Is it? Wait. Wait. Maybe it's none. Wait, did we fail arts class? I've never been to art class. Really? Oh no! <laughs> Why did he do that? Wait, Why you did have he a bad do day. That? You take your one dance. <laughs> you sing a sad song and you turn it around. Please, please. Oh my God! Why did he that do that? That is so sad. Why did he? What do a godlike mix-up from Jed! Ah! He just held it! Oh. He's like, yo, you wanna see something cool? <laughs> something he's never done the entire set, nor to any other Olimar? I'm just gonna hold Shine, baby! You know what's funny is that once he commits to the up smash, he's just dead! <laughs> he just has to wait at home! He knew that Ray was gonna <laughs> run up and up he smash! He's like, wait. you know what, I'm just gonna... Because he originally used the Shine as A to stall midair, yes. and B to potentially reflect the Pikmin. But once he found himself on the ground, he's like, you dumbass, you're gonna run up and up smash! So he just held it! <laughs>